Hi YouTube and welcome back to part two. As you can see we just moved over um, or went over Burley uh, level crossing and then I turn left in amongst these houses. I'm going to speed it up again just really so we can get through. You can see really what it looks like. It's just lots of built up trees all round and grown up around us and a lot of tall hedgerows and things like that. And I will pause from time to time. There's a cattle grid to keep the animals off this main road. And then from here, what I'm going to do is turn right and head towards Burley. And again, as we go along, I will speed it up from time to time. But as you can see, the summer's out. Um, the summer is now in the UK. Lots of greenery around now. I think I did shoot a little bit before in the past when you, uh, if you go back over my videos in the winter out here, and it is quite a bare place in the winter. And this is an open area now and I'll explain a little bit to why that is as we go further on into this video. I'm going to do a slow this down and then turn right here. I'm turning right at place Beaulieu straight on. Um, Hatchet's Pond is to our right hand side and as we go along the road you will see Hatchet's Pond. It's quite a large pond Nothing like you get in the U in the USA when you have great big massive lakes. This is a it's called Hatchet's Pond, but I think you know does it qualify to be a lake over a certain size? Not quite sure what the what gives it a right to be a lake or a pond. Anyway, as you can see it there, a lot of fishermen. Um, I fished there once, I think, not very successful. Um, probably would never fish there again. So now heading up here, what I'm going to do is just slow this down in a minute. I'll speed this bit up. I'm going to slow the next bit down. Just so you can see the amount of motorbikes that are going past. You do get these groups from you know time to time that come a drive out through the new forest or ride out through the new forest. Got trailers on everything, probably camping somewhere in the forest. Anyway let's move this on a bit and turn right just here. Now turning right this is a old World War II Airdrome. Um, this was used to help support the evasion of Europe. And we're just going to grind up this gravel track. Some more animals there on the right. And turn right. Those white vans that you can see on the left hand side, they're like camper vans um, that are on the, one of the main airstrips. You can see this better from the air when we fly over on the way to Jersey. You can see this laid out airport. All the uh, side runways or taxiways and these vans here they're used um, they go and drop orienteering groups off in the forest and then they drive here and park and then they wait for the orienteering group to come back um, they arrive just after we arrived here and they fly metal model aircraft here as well right where you can see them in front of us so that was the end of this quick video um, next one to follow have a great day.